What is going on my friends? Welcome back to a brand new video. Today we're going to be talking about Dragon Ball Universe 2 DLC Pack 6. Now, over the last couple of months, ever since I started doing these videos, you guys have been asking me, you're like, Cog, please, please try to get Bandai Dips to give us spiky hair for our Super Saiyans. We do have spiky hair. It's just not spiky, spiky, spiky like how it should be. And obviously, if you look at, you know, Super Saiyan 3 or the Super Saiyan Super Vegeta transformation, the hair kind of does look spiky. But it's not exactly what you guys want. And I agree with you guys. We should have spiky hair for the transformations, even further spiky hair than what we already have now. I mean, while it is happening, we're getting like a Hercule outfit for... Uh, your created characters in DLC pack 6 so we're getting Hercules outfit from Dragon Ball Super and also we're even getting um, From what it appears to be a spiky wig on Hercule um, on For your custom created character so from what it seems like we're getting a spiky hair like spiky wig or something That is in Super Saiyan form that we're gonna be able to unlock I don't know if it's either going to be through TP Metal Shop or if it's going to be through Parallel Quest or anything like that. But from what we know, we're getting a new wig and it is really spiky. So spiky hair is definitely a thing that is going to happen in DLC Pack 6. And uh, I know it's probably not exactly what you guys wanted. And I am definitely siding with you guys on this here because... They shouldn't just give us a wig to, to you know, like, rub it off and, and just, like, try to cover their tracks. I mean, I feel like they should definitely make the Super Saiyan transformations have more spiky hair. Uh, they should definitely be more styled and more like the actual anime. And to me, I don't mind the way it is. I don't, I don't think it's too bad. Uh, however, on some of the characters, the Super Saiyan transformation does kind of look a little wonky, but... Uh, to me, personally, I, I think it's okay. You know, I go Super Saiyan 3 and I just launch a supernova attack and I don't really think twice or really, like, think about, you know, the Super Saiyan 3 form once I transform and be like, hey, I wish this had super spiky hair because when I do look at it, it does kind of look like spiky hair. Um, but there are definitely certain aspects of it that should, you know, definitely be more on point and should be more styled and spiked up. So, uh, we're getting a wig and that's probably going to be able to just be blown off as soon as we transform it to Super Saiyan 3 or something. I don't know, but uh, this wig, you know, it doesn't look too bad, you know. I, I don't know, like, what do you guys think of it? With all that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. That's pretty much a wrap on today's video. Give this video a thumbs up if y'all are super excited for this wig. Um, and to finally have spiked hair for your created characters. Uh, other than that, I hope you guys had a great day, and, uh, don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications if you guys are new to the channel and you haven't done that already. Thank you guys so much for watching, I really appreciate the support on these videos, and, uh, with all that being said, I hope y'all have a fantastic day, a fantastic Merry Christmas, and I will catch y'all next time. Peace.